fans will spend some time and money there. Fox 7's Ann White Little is live in Elroy to tell us more about that. You visited with the folks in Bastrop, Ann White. Yeah, good morning, Catherine. Things are certainly starting to pick up out here at the track, and Bastrop has formed an F1 task force. They hope that fans visiting from uh, out everywhere will enjoy small town Texas and a city that's making a comeback. On a normal day, we're 25 minutes from uh, the Coda track. Proximity puts this city of 7,000 in the Formula One mix. And Dave Quinn knows it. We're not expecting everybody to come to Bastrop, but we figure a fair share will come and enjoy it. As the director of the Bastrop Economic Development Corporation, Quinn put together a task force. We look for opportunities to roll out the red carpet to our guests. Helping businesses make the most of race weekend for both fans and the city. Almost all of Jonathan Adams' rooms at the Holiday Inn Express are booked. Renovations completed just in time for the international visitors he's expecting. The staffing levels have been changed and we're making sure that it's kind of just kind of all hands on deck. And on the wheel for Lee Harrell, who owns Bastrop River Company. So the river business is not exactly booming this time of year. But with new permits, he's bringing a first to Bastrop. What I've done is taken my uh, fleet of vehicles that I use for the river company and turned it into a local transit service because Bastrop does not have that and uh, doesn't need it on a regular basis. Ads on brochures in these welcome bags are paying for the shuttle around the city, free to visitors. A ride Deborah Johnson hopes race fans will catch to her art gallery when they aren't at the track. We also have um, increased some of our western art. We want people to be able to take home a flavor of Texas and Bastrop. While Quinn will have to wait on hard numbers, his office knows November will be a good month for Bastrop. We want to be able to show uh, what a great experience you can have from right here in Bastrop, Texas. And back out live, we are just off of turn nine on the 3.4 mile circuit. The gates open to fans uh, just a few minutes ago, and as you can see, some of them are already in the stands. The choppers are up in the sky, and I'll tell you, we have seen just about one of every type of vehicle pass by us on this road, moving equipment and people into place as thousands are expected to be out here today for F1 race weekend. We'll send it back to you. See any cool cars pass by in Wyatt? Oh, plenty of cool <laughs> cars. Courtesy shuttles, Catherine. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> All right, thank you.